Don't forget to leave a like and subscribe to the where you're on to go to the website Welcome back. I'm Pastor Doug. This is Rowan. Tonight we are reading from 1 Samuel chapter 2, verses 1 to 11. Welcome to a moment of joy. As always, man, I can't see through those glasses. Anyways, as always, we encourage you to, to read along with us. Uh, 1 Samuel is towards the beginning of the Bible. It's about a third of the way through. It comes after Ruth, which we read about a year ago, and before 2 Samuel, which we'll be reading <sighs> in about a month. In about a month or so. Well, no, we got to read uh, 1 Corinthians and then we'll read 2 Samuel. About two months. Yeah. Okay. So anyways, welcome to a moment of joy. Wait, no, no, in about three months, because you forgot to put something on our list that I'll correct you about okay. later. Then Hannah prayed and said, My heart rejoices in the Lord. In the Lord my horn is lifted high. My mouth boasts over my enemies, for I delight in your deliverance. There is no one holy like the Lord. There is no one beside you. There is no rock like our God. Do not keep talking so proudly. Or let your mouth speak such arrogance, for the Lord is God, who knows, by him deeds are weighed. The bows of the warriors are broken, and those who stumble are armed with strength. Those who were full hire themselves out for food, but those who are hungry are hungry no more. She who was barren has borne seven children. And she who has had many sons pines away. The Lord brings death and makes alive. He brings down to the grave and raises up. The Lord sends poverty and wealth. He humbles and exalts. He raises the poor from the dust and lifts the needy from the ash heap. He seats them with princes and has them inherit the throne of honor. For the foundations of the earth are the Lord's, on them he has set the world. He will guard their feet, he will guard the feet of his faithful servants, but the wicked will be silent in the place of darkness. It is not by strength that one prevails. Those who oppose the Lord will be broken. The Most High will thunder from heaven. The Lord will judge the ends of the earth. He will give strength to his king and exalt the horn of his anointed. Then Elkanah went home to Ramah, but the boy ministered before the Lord under Eli the priest. Any questions? No. Okay. Um, yeah, that, that's a pretty, pretty powerful prayer, right? Eh? Mm-hmm. So, and, and Let's point it out. I know it's obvious. We're going to point it out. This is this is a a, a ladies' prayer being recorded. So anybody that that questions ladies' ability to to lead, really needs to read the Bible more because there's a whole lot of prayers uh, recorded by by women. So you know what? That's a that's something to, to keep in mind. Okay, um, not that that has anything to do with what what we're talking about tonight, but it's, it's a side note, a little sidebar, you got a little distracted. Um, but God exalts the humble, and he humbles the, the proud. That's, that's the, the purpose, that's the point here. So. Okay, let's pray. I don't see any prayer requests, so. Dear Lord Jesus, we thank you for all that you give us, and we pray, oh, that's a scary prayer, isn't it, to pray for humility, we, we pray that, that um, we pray that we're not proud, and, and, and that we honor you, and we honor those around us, we put the needs of, of others above our own. We praise you, Lord Jesus. She is a servant king, not a servant king. You give us the example. 
and click on create a folder. It creates your own changes. It's crazy. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, we'll see you tomorrow evening at 8.30 for another moment of joy. Do you have anything to add? Oh, you were going to talk about something else. No, that was, that's what I'm part of. Yeah. Okay. All right. We'll, we'll see you tomorrow evening. Bye-bye.